team that brought you Magic Carpet are also responsible for PC games you all know, like uh, Syndicate, Populous, and this year's big hit Theme Park. Games like this take an enormously long time to develop, and the head of programmers on Magic Carpet and the others is this man here, Peter Molyneux. Hi. Welcome to Bad Influence. Thank you. Some of the early software you brought to show us, yeah. um, this is kind of stuff that you started with and then rejected. What did you reject first, well, as it were? This was about three years ago, and as you can see, although it's fairly smooth and you, you are travelling over a landscape, there's too many blocks there. And if you look at this, this uh, door there, it just flickers too much. Yeah. So we rejected that. So that one was out of the window. Yeah. So what did you go to next, then? Okay, let me just show you that. So with this technique, you can see that the ground is actually much, much smoother, mm. but we couldn't have the range of colours right. uh, that we needed to, to show above land. So we switched it to below water, but we, we really weren't, still weren't happy with it. Okay, so that went out of the window as well. So yeah, what do we get so to we next? So we start again. Uh, and I'll just move to that now. Now with this technique here, you can see a lot of the, a lot of the magic carpet elements coming in. We've yeah. got the landscape, we've got the sea and the coast, and these trees. When you're programming initially, you have to grab graphics from absolutely anywhere. Yeah, those are populous yeah, trees, aren't they? Right. You've they are, nicked yeah. those. How many years ago is this? This is about a year ago. Okay, now there's no gameplay here though, is there? No, no, absolutely none at all. That's where the problems really start. And we have to, we've got the engine, we have to squeeze a game in there. And we do that by just testing and playing and testing and playing. Okay, well it's been very interesting seeing the game in development. Thank you very much indeed for coming in.